Now to the latest on the Russian invasion of Ukraine. News 12 New Jersey's Alex Zidane is in the Alert Center with the newest information that you need to know right now. Alex. Calling a developing story out of Poland, Vice President Harris sitting down with the Polish Prime Minister just a short time ago, talking about obviously Ukraine and the NATO alliance. This after both Poland and the United States backed off a plan to supply Ukraine with more fighter jets as we hear more about the death toll, three people killed in the Russian bombing of that hospital. Now, this sort of cockamamie scheme of trying to get fighter planes to Ukraine is really part of the delicate balancing act that NATO is doing to try to not provoke Russia further. And it certainly might make sense because you look at the map, there's NATO countries on this side, Russia on this side, unfortunately, Ukraine is caught in the middle. We're also keeping an eye on those peace talks that just concluded. Unfortunately, not very satisfactory from either side. It looks like the, the talks did not result in any sort of ceasefire, but the, both sides continue to keep talking. They will be doing that. Here is Ukraine's foreign minister talking to the media right afterward. Not a lot of progress, but we hope to continue those talks throughout the day. We'll keep an eye on that on Poland and on Washington, where there is legislation being passed to ban Russian oil. For now, guys, I'll send it back to you.